Now in this topic we will learn how the Sahos projection formula will converted into a features projection formula. Hmm. There are lots of tax is written but uh, how the conversion is happening that is written in the text format but we don't need to be bother about the text I will explain all the things. Here the Sahos projection formula is converted to a features projection formula. This is a standard format of features position formula. This is a wedge formula. This is a wedge, wedge horizontal line is a wedge, vertical line is a dash. It is dash, vertical line is a dash. Now, this is a uh, Sahar position formula. First of all, we have to rotate this by a 60 degree. This is a wedge, this is a dash, this is a wedge, this is a dash. This need to be rotated as 60 degree when it uh, uh, 180 degree this need to be rotated 120 degree that's why 1 2 3 3 bond is here so the angle between these two bond will be 120 degree so if you rotate 120 degree then the waist will be going upward side and rest will in the towards viewer and this CST will go in downward direction this form will be getting this will come to the front this will go to the dash and CS3 will go in downward direction now this is the fine now this is structure we are getting now this structure we are getting by the rotation about 120 degree this is a 120 degree rotated now this structure you are getting this is a waist the wedge and if you view from this side if you view from this side and this is a waist this is a wedge this is dash and dash if you view from this side and we have to number this uh, 1 2 3 4 any side we have numbering and 1 2 3 4 for understanding purpose I am doing the numbering and this CS3 will come to this position this H this H will be and this OH H and OH will be in the one side and this bromine and this H dash bromine dash H will be in the one side of the features position formula this uh, OH this H will be in the same side this is a carbon is taken this carbon is taken this is the numbering is uh, not in good way actually numbering will be done 1 2 3 4 because alcohol will be given priority this is a uh, functional group the 1 2 3 4 is numbering is done this OH in the right side if it be from this side this is the right side this is in the left side dash will be in the left side this OH in the right side as will be in the left side now this second uh, third carbon atoms this is the third carbon atoms H will in the right side bromine will in the left side as in the right side this is bromine in the left side as in the right side bromine in the left side now this is converted to a features position formula <coughs> now this compound is given then if you don't want to rotate about 120 degree if you didn't want to rotate 120 degree <coughs> then can also be converted to a features position formula <coughs> we need to think that this is a wedge this is a dash if you rotate this then this wedge become dash this dash become wedge if we, we didn't rotate then this wedge <coughs> if you view from this side <coughs> if you ro didn't rotate if you view from this side then this wedge will be in the right side and this bromine is coming towards viewer is it is outward directions in outward view this is an outward side bromine is a waste this is an outward side but if it is not it is in the downward in it is in a downward side if we didn't rotate then this bromine will be in the left side this is in the OH in the right side and this bromine in the left side if we rotate this then the structure will be like this if we rotate this then the structure will be this is a H this is a OH if we rotate this if you rotate this one mm, 120 degree if you rotate this 120 degree then the structure will be this is a not correct maybe this way this is H this is a OH if you rotate 120 degree this is if, if you rotate 120 degree then this H this H is in, is in dash positions after rotating 120 degree this H will be in the wedge positions and bromine will be in the dash positions if you view from this side then this OH and H will be in the outer side and this bromine H will be in the 
left side this h and this bromine in the left side this carbon is 1 2 3 4 1 2 this is 1 2 3 4 2 carbon 2 carbon OH in the right side if you will from this side and this H in the right side this is in the OH and H this OH and this H in the right side and this H this H this H will be in the left side and this bromine will be in the left side if you didn't rotate then directly you can put this will be the opposite opposite will be in the left side h will be in the right side this wedge will be in the left side this is a left side and h will be in the right side in this way you can convert the source process projection formula into a uh, features position formula now the features position formula is can also be converted into a source position formula i have already explained this is a waste test waste test projection formula This is a feature position formula, it's converted to a waste test position formula, waste test again converted to a saw position formula. This is a saw position formula. After 120 rotations, this waste test converted to a saw horse position formula. Here, by this feature position formula, we can convert the saw position formula, we can directly can convert. If we view from this side, uh, if we will H and CL will be in the same side and this fluorine hydrogen will be in the same side. This CL and H will be in the same side, fluorine hydrogen will be one side. If we view from this side, if we view from this side, chlorine hydrogen will be in the first this hydrogens, it, it is in the upper side and this fluorine hydrogen will be in the one side in the dash positions. After 120 degree rotations, chlorine will go in the dash positions. This chlorine in, here is the chlorine in the wedge position. Now after the rotations, 120 degree. This is strong uh, something wrong. Actually, this will be the hydrogens. Here will be the hydrogens, and this will be the chlorine. After 120 degree rotations, waste changes to dash, dash changes to waste. This is I've already explained in the features position formula how the source position formula is converted. I've already explained this concept. This is the most easiest concept, and never be the any neither is any no any chance to be wrong. So this is the general format to remember and learn. Now we will learn how the changing an Iman position formula into a waste test position formula.